And now, ladies and gentlemen, please ride for God Bless America, sung by vocalist and Pasadena native, Ms. Jacqueline Ibarra. God bless America, land that I love. Stand beside her and guide her through the night with the light from above, from the mountains to the prairies to the ocean white with foam can bless America my home sweet home God bless America Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the 27th anniversary Keenak Awards, powered by great minds in STEM from the historic Pasadena Civic Auditorium. And now, please welcome tonight's Master of Ceremonies, the host of Extra on NBC, Mr. Mario Lopez. everyone good evening it's great to be here and welcome uh, officially to the 27th annual HENAC Awards powered by great minds in STEM yes <laughs> they were shoveling food down my ears I guess is better pardon me uh, I'm, I'm thrilled to be here tonight I'm learning so much and I'm so happy and, and um, it's fantastic to be uh, amongst uh, so many talented uh, intelligent individuals and and um, uh, here at the Pasadena Civic Auditorium of course and we're going to be honoring and celebrating the world-class achievements of Hispanics in science technology engineering and math the theme for the 2015 HENAC Awards and for the entire four-day conference is ignite and inspire now the ignite part of this equation is a tribute to Pasadena and Southern California uh, a region home to iconic institutions like NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory, the Rose Parade, which happened right here in Pasadena, and of course, uh, Hollywood, and Disneyland, which is Orange County, but that's okay. <coughs> Excuse me. Now, whether we're talking about advances in technology that have, that have taken us to the moon, to Mars, and beyond, or the cre creativity and innovation 
of our entertainment industry, these institutions have been igniting imaginations all around the world for decades upon decades. Tonight, though, <clears throat> is about the inspire side of the equation. And as you'll see throughout the evening, the excellence represented by the 2015 HENAC Award winners is truly inspirational. And I want to say that again, the excellence of the HENAC Award winners is what's inspirational. <clears throat> and I repeat that because it gets to the core of what we're honoring. Since the first class of award winners back in 1989, the HENAC Awards have been about excellence in the Latino community. For 27 years, these outstanding role models have represented not only the best the Latino community has to offer, they represent the best America has to offer, period. <clears throat> and if you've been paying any attention to the news media at all the past few months, you know, of course, that the 2016 presidential election is in full swing. And you also may have noticed a certain individual who uh, shall remain nameless, uh, getting a lot of attention for some shall we say, insensitive statements about Hispanics and Mexicanos in particular. Now, tonight's not about politics. We all have our own opinions, and I'm sure we're all going to be dealing with issues like this in our own way over the next year. But tonight is a chance to respond, not by protesting or by boycotting or shouting down people who share this particular opinion. Tonight, we have a chance to actually show America what we're capable of as a community. It's about highlighting. <clears throat> it is about highlighting examples of exceptional people who prove that despite the disparaging attitudes still unfortunately held by many in our country and despite obstacles that too many of our people still face the Hispanic population can and does very much produce outstanding engineers and scientists. And it's about the STEM community of all races and political stripes standing up proudly as one to say, America, hey, these are our best and these are your best and they are world class.